What is up guys? It is Joe here from Joe Talks Wrestling. And this video is being recorded and uploaded on Thursday the 19th of March 2020. This is a serious video. Now I don't like doing these but this one has to be done. So this is a little update about how the coronavirus or COVID-19 is going to affect my content personally. And in this I'm going to dive into some things that I had planned to come to the channel this year that now pretty much won't be able to happen. Um, and I'm gonna have to do a little background on this. I don't know how long this video is gonna be. I'm just gonna try and cover everything that I need to and we'll see about length later. But essentially, today I got a message from my job, my workplace, saying that we are closing down until the coronavirus epidemic is subsided. And that is at least two months. I am recording, I have recorded Anthony's Open Challenge, Zach Rhodes' Open Challenge. We've got a story that's coming soon and we want to continue that story through to about May time. Um, and that's hopefully going to be able to happen, but it may not be able to happen how I initially uh, visualised it. But um, over the next like you know few weeks and months, we want, a, I, I'm planning to build a story. And that story culminated. A lot of you, if you've seen me on the Billy Brook podcast, then you would know I've been saving for a wrestling ring um, for quite a while now. And I, um, I was very close and I was hoping to get it in around June time. But due to the nature of my workplace closing down, that's not going to happen. And it's messed everything up. So due to financially me not being able to afford the wrestling ring, a lot of stuff I plan, which I'm still not gonna, I'm not gonna give away all the details because hopefully soon, one day, I can still buy a wrestling ring in my backyard and we can do this. Um, and this wrestling ring is a decision that I've been wanting to do for a while. A lot of you don't know about me personally. I've been training at the New Breed Wrestling Association um, wrestling school in Banbury in Oxfordshire and I knew I had to go and train there before I made my mind up about the ring and I loved every minute of it so that's how I knew I'd, I'd, I'd want to do this. Also um, I'm a kickboxer so that's all been put on hold and just a lot of people and I know I'm a kids YouTuber so I've got to try and keep up beat and all of my content that's coming out over the next few months, it may be limited, but at the same time, I'm going to try do my utmost best to try and make it so it's an escape from reality for you guys. So you can sit down, watch my videos and forget about what's going on in the real world right now, because what's happening is serious. Nothing like this in my lifetime, especially. I'm only 17 years old. Nothing in my lifetime has ever happened like this, um, to this extent anyway. And a lot of people don't realise the extent this is going to be. Um... We could literally be in lockdown at any minute. So it's, I don't know really how to explain it, but I just wanted to let you guys know that I have stuff planned for AOC and Zach Rowe Open Challenge. They are still planned to happen. Um, but the wrestling ring, a lot of you like that knew that I was going to be getting that, that's off the cards right now. Um, I physically can't afford to do the, put in the groundwork for the wrestling ring and I can't afford the wrestling ring itself right now. So that's been put on hold. English summer over here is a nightmare. I wanted to be able to have the ring so I could do a lot of filming work during the months of June to August time, where the sun is. And after August, September, October, November, December is a nosedive all the way until around April time where it starts getting sunny again. That's just how the UK is. So I literally, each year, to do some proper great filming work, I normally have three months to do some proper wrestling in the backyard and it's not going to happen this time around which absolutely sucks I mean no one is as gutted as I am about it all quite frankly and I know even the idea of the wrestling ring is news to a lot of you but it's not going to happen at this rate um, I'm hoping I can still do work with other YouTubers, um, hopefully Kip in particular. I'm hoping the promo competition is going to go ahead as planned. I don't know, that's up to him, not me. But a lot of stuff is going to change and a lot of stuff is going to be affected. 
But I just wanted to let you guys know that I do have a random promos going up this Sunday. Um, Anthony's Open Challenge is up. There's also going to be one. There's a Zach Rowe Open Challenge, not next week, the week after. And two weeks after that, there will be another Zach Rowe Open Challenge. Other than that, that's all we filmed so far. Um, but yeah, coronavirus is a nightmare and it's going to affect my content. There is no two ways about it. It's already affected my college work. Um, we're meant to be shooting like different promotional videos and projects in college that we can no longer do because I'm pretty certain that college is going to be closed next week and everything has been put on hold. I've, I'm on a gap year next year, meaning I've got a whole year essentially to do what I want to do, which is make YouTube videos. And I wanted to make wrestling content in the wrestling ring. It's the only year of my life I have left where I literally have nothing to do. I have no responsibility other than my job, which I still have. I'm still employed. I just want to make that clear. I am still an employee of where I work, but I just can't work there for the time being. Uh, and that could be two months. That could be six months. It's all over the place. It depends when this epidemic peaks and when society and the government feel it's okay for us to go back to work. Um, but... I mean, I'm going to try, I assure you, I'm going to try my hardest to make the best possible content I can make throughout all of this epidemic. But, I mean, you guys, you're probably not going to be that disappointed because nothing's going to change for you. But, oh my God, I had so much planned. I had so much cool stuff planned. I even started planning to do another rumble. Um and it's all been put on hold because of the coronavirus epidemic and a lot of stuff's going to change so it's not just about youtube anymore it's personally so i don't dive into my personal background because it's not for you guys to know you shouldn't need to know you don't need to know me personally uh, i'm just a youtuber but if I'm obviously only 17 years old. I still live at home with my parents. If for whatever reason they lose their jobs or they can't work, that means there's no income coming into the house. Meaning there's not going to be as much food. There's not going to be like, a, it just, it's a downward spiral that's waiting to happen. And there's no real way out of such. But I just want to let you guys know, no matter what happens, unless it's something that I feel I genuinely can't make videos because of it, I'm going to be trying my utmost hardest to get content out for you guys because I have not spent the last three years building this channel for it to be stopped by a virus. I'm not going to let it happen. So, yeah, I just want to get this out there to let you guys know that, once again, I'm trying my best and I'm not, I don't have enough money. I don't have a lot of money to run this. Um, yes, I've got my ring savings, but I'm not gonna dive into them unless I need to because I still wanna buy a ring eventually. Um, wrestling trainees canceled. I'm probably not gonna be kickboxing for a while because I can't afford it. Um, and that's plain and simple, but it's just, it's not a good situation for any of us, but I want to be the escapism. I want you guys to be able to watch my content and think, you know what? I'm enjoying it for what it is. So I just want to let you guys know I'm going to be trying to produce the best content I can. Maybe the quality, maybe, you know, it's dropped a little, it'll drop a little bit. I don't want that at all. But the reality of the situation is I'm normally one of them that says, if you're not at your best, don't do it at all. But if I want to get content out for you guys, some things might have to be sacrificed. But at the end of the day, I just wanted to hope that everyone out there that's watching this video, I hope you stay safe. I hope your family stay safe. I hope you're all taking the necessary precautions to um, avoid the coronavirus. Obviously, don't go out and panic buy 100 packs of toilet roll, because if you do that, quite honestly, you know, you're not helping anyone um, because other people are just going to not be able to use it. And then it's just, oh, well, I'm not going to get into that. Um you guys are younger audiences, so I'm going to say, you know, don't worry. All will work out in the end, but I'm just letting you guys know that my content may suffer. Um, 
my ideas have definitely suffered. Stuff I had planned has definitely suffered, but that's not for you guys to worry about because I never made any of it public anyway, in case something like this happened where I can't do any of it. So I just wanted to let you know I did have stuff planned, but it's sort of now I'm on the back foot a bit because I don't know what to do. Um, but yeah, I've been Joe from Joe Talks Wrestling. Once again, stay safe, guys, um, and I will hopefully see you in the next video very shortly. Goodbye.